It is a big night here. I'm Chris Cuomo. Welcome to primetime. We have one of the Michael Cohen tapes, the secret recording of President Trump back in 2016 made by Cohen in which he and then candidate Trump discuss arrangements surrounding a payment to former Playboy playmate Karen McDougal that was made by a third party, David Pecker, as head of the National Enquirer. This all happened in the months before the election. Now, this is not a great quality recording, and that will be relevant to its analysis. So first I want to play you the entire recording, not all of which is relevant to the payment. So listen for yourself. Let me know what's happening, okay? Oh. Oh. Maybe because of this it would be better if you didn't go, you know? Maybe because of this, for that one, you know, I think what we should do is get rid of this because it's so false what they're saying. It's such bullshit. Um, I think I think this goes away quickly. I think what I think it's probably better. Do the Charleston thing, just this time. Uh, yeah, in two weeks it's fine. I think right now it's it's better. You know? Okay, honey, you take care of yourself. Thanks, Pam. Yep, yeah, I'm proud of you. So long. Bye. What's up, Mike? Great poll, by the way. Yeah. See you. Great poll. Making progress. Big time. And you guys are good guys. Yeah. Oh, Pastor Scott? I believe it. No, no, Pastor Scott. What's, what's happening? Oh, no. Who's, can we use him anymore? Oh, yeah. No, you're talking about Mark Burns. He, we told him well, just... I, I don't mean that. Uh, Mark Burns, can we use him? No. Anymore? No. Richard um, Leffer, I'm sorry. Richard uh, Leffer just called. He just said we have a chance. He had an idea for you. Okay. Um, so we... Got served from the New York Times. I told you this we were regarding oh, wow. to unseal the divorce papers with Ivana. Um, we're fighting it. Uh, Kasowitz is going to you never be able to get that. Done. Never, never. Kasowitz doesn't they'll ever be able. They don't have a. Give me a legitimate, cup, please. They don't have a legitimate purpose. And you so, have a, a woman that doesn't want to see it. Correct. Right. So, so you've been yes, it. and it's all it's been going on for a while. for about two, three weeks now. All you have to do is delay it for. Even after that, it's not going to ever be opened. There's no, there's no purpose for it. Um, told you about Charleston. Um, I need to open up a company for the transfer of all of that info regarding our friend David. You know, so that I'm going to do that right away. I've actually come up and I've spoken, to and I've spoken to Alan Weiselberg about how to set the whole thing up uh, with so what are we gonna funding. That, uh, yes. Um, and it's all the yeah, stuff, all the stuff, because, you know, you never know where that company, you never know where he's going to be. Gets it, but Correct. So I'm, I'm all over that. And I spoke to Alan about it when it comes time for the financing, which will be... Listen, what financing? We'll have to pay you. So. No, 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 no. I got... No, no, no. Hey, Bill, how are you?